Hello mga kids, welcome back to Mathematics Grade 4. Always remember that math is fun and easy. Tara na, simulan na natin. Mathematics Grade 4, Fourth Quarter, Week 4, Lesson 1. Learning Competency, Solves Routine and Non-Routine Problems Involving the Volume of Rectangular Perism. Let us have first a short review. Answer the following question below. Number one question, what is the formula to find the volume of rectangular perism? What is your answer? Very good. V equal to length times width times height. Number two question class, what is the formula to find the area of a rectangle? What is your answer? Very good. A equal to length times width. Number three question class, what is the formula to find the area of a parallelogram? What is your answer? Very good. A equal to base times height. Number four question, what is the formula to find the area of a square? What is your answer? Very good. A equal to S times S. Number five question class, what is the formula to find the area of a trapezoid? What is your answer? Very good. A equal to B1 plus B2 times height divide 2. Let us proceed to our topic class. Solve routine and non-routine problems involving volume of rectangular perism. Rectangular perism is a solid figure that has 6 faces, 12 edges, and 8 vertices. Rectangular perism has 3-dimensional, the length, the width, and the height. To find the volume of this rectangular perism, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height. We assume that the length of this rectangular perism is 10 cm, the width is 5 cm, and the height is 6 cm. Next process, perform the operation. Multiply 10 times 5 equal to 50 times 6 equal to 300 cm cube. The volume of Rectangular perism. Next example, solve the problem. Make both a rectangular aquarium. The length of the aquarium is 12 cm, the width is 10 cm, and 8 cm height. Find the volume of an aquarium. To solve the problem, we follow the four steps. Understand, plan, solve, and check and look back. The first step to solve the problem is understand. We answer the following question, what is asked, and what are the given facts? So the answer for what is asked, the volume of an aquarium. And the answer for what are given, the length is equal to 12 cm, the width is 10 cm, and the height is 8 cm. The next step is plan. We answer the following question, what operation to be used, or formula. So the answer to the question is, Multiplication, and we use the formula V equal to length times width times height. The next step is solve. Show the solution using the formula. We use the formula V equal to length times width times height. We substitute the value length equal to 12 cm, width 10 cm, and height equal to 8 cm, and then perform the operation. The volume of the aquarium is 960 cm3. The last step is check and look back. State your answer. Therefore, the volume of an aquarium is 960 cm3. Before we proceed to our activity class, again, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height to find the volume of rectangular perism. And then we follow the steps. Understand, plan, solve, check and look back. Solve the problem, show your solution. A toy box is in the shape of rectangular perism. It is 35 cm long and 15 cm high. If it is width is 20 cm, what is the volume of the box? We use the formula V equal to length times width times height to solve the problem. And then, we substitute the value. The length is 35 cm, the height is 15 cm, and the width is 20 cm. And then, perform the operation. 
Therefore, the volume of the rectangular perisem is equal to 10,500 centimeter cube. Number 2 problem class. A wooden box is 24 centimeter long, 18 centimeter wide, and 9 centimeter high. How much space does it enclose? How do you solve the problem class? Again, we use the formula length times width times height and then substitute the value length equal to 24 cm width equal to 18 cm and height equal to 9 cm then perform the operation therefore the volume of a wooden box is 3888 cm cube number 3 problem class an open box is 60 cm long 30 cm wide and 25 cm high find the volume of the box What is as in the problem class? The answer is the volume of the box. Next question class, what are given? The given are 60 cm long, 30 cm wide, and 25 cm high. The next question class, what operation you will use or what is the formula? We use multiplication and the formula V equal to length times width times height. The next question class, Show your solution using the formula. We use the formula V equal to length times width times height and then substitute the value. Length or long equal to 60 cm, the width equal to 30 cm and 25 cm height. We perform the operation multiplication 60 times 25 times 30. The product is 45,000 cm cubed, the volume of the box. The last question class, check and look back. State your answer. The volume of the box is 45,000 cm cube. Number 4 problem class, the width, the height, and the volume of a rectangular perisem are 5 cm, 3 cm, and 120 cm cube. Respectively, find the length of the perisem. How do you solve the problem class? To solve the problem, we use the formula V equal to length times width times height and then substitute the value. 120 cm cube, the volume, 5 cm, the width, and 3 cm, the height. Then perform the operation. 5 times 3 equal to 15 cm squared. And then the next process class, we divide both sides by 15 cm squared. If we divide 120 cm cube by 15 cm squared, the result is 8 cm. And then if we divide 15 cm squared by 15 cm squared, the result is L or 1. Therefore, class, the length of the rectangular perisem is 8 cm. Number 5 question class, a refrigerator has a square base with each side that measures 60 cm and 122 cm height. Find the volume of the refrigerator. What is your answer class? We use the formula V equal to length times width times height and then substitute the value 60 cm times 60 cm times 122 cm high. The volume of the refrigerator is 439,200 cm cube. That's all for today class. I hope you learned a lot. Always remember that math is fun and easy. Keep safe everyone.